Hi there, friends. Welcome to week three, lesson one of phonemic awareness with me, Miss Cockrum. So I've actually got a friend here who is clinging on to me because she really wants to participate. So everybody welcome, Yeti. Hi, everybody. I'm Miss Cockrum's friend. I'm so glad you're my friend too, Yeti. Do you know what we're doing? No, what are we doing? We're gonna do some rhyming today. So the class has already been doing this, but it's a little bit different today. I'm going to say a word, you're going to say the word, and then I'm gonna give you two words and you're gonna tell me which one rhymes. So for example, I'm going to say got, you're going to say bot, and then I'm gonna say which rhymes with got, hot or most? Got, hot. That's right. You ready for this, Yeti? Question one. The word is sat. What rhymes with sat? Seat or bat? Sat, bat. That's right. Next word is get. Get. What word rhymes? Let or feet? Get, let. That's right. Next up, the word is mop. Which word rhymes with mop? Dip or hop? Mop, hop. Good job, Yeti. Next up, the word is ham. What word rhymes with ham? Ram or he? Ham, ram. That's right, Yeti. Next word we have is sun. Sun. Which word rhymes? Run or tan? Run. Sun, run. That's right. All right, next word we have bit. Bit. What word rhymes? Fit or got? Fit, fit. That's right, Yeti. Last word. The word is red. What rhymes with red? Is it bed or bus? That one's really easy. Red, bed. That's right, Yeti. I'm glad you thought that was easy. We're gonna do some harder things now, and I know you're getting tired because today's been super long. So do you wanna say bye to everybody? Bye, everybody. All right, give them a wave. I'm gonna help you get off me here. All right, bye. Thank you, Yeti. We're gonna go back to what we do, what we know. I'm gonna say two words. You're going to give me the beginning sound. So repeat after me. You're gonna, so you're gonna repeat after me and you're gonna give me a thumbs up if they start with the same sound and a thumbs down if they don't start with the same sound. For example, muffin middle. Yes. They start with a mmm. Next two words we have helping happy. Helping happy. Huh. Yes. The next word we have pieces capital. Pieces capital. No. Next up we have better before. Better before. But yes. Next up we have kitten. Letters. Kitten letters. No, that's not the same. All right, folks, now I'm going to give you two words. You're going to say the two words, then we're going to put them together. All righty? So we have... I made a mistake there, friends. We're not separating words. We are on to something different because it's week three. We are doing syllables. So those are different sounds in the word. So, for example, the word is napkin. 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 All right, different syllables. We have bliss, tur. Bliss, tur. Blister. Next up, we have mal ten. Mal ten. Mountain. Next up, we have chill, dren. Children. Children. Next up, we have bass. 
kit, bath, kit, basket. Next up we have sis, ter, sis, ter, sister. Next up we have can, d, can, d, candy. Last but not least we have e, go, e. Go, eagle. Alrighty, we're gonna do isolating the final sound of a word. So I'm gonna say the word, you're gonna say the word, and we're gonna punch up the last sound. Ready? The word is self. Self. The word is could. Could. The word is whole. Whole. The word is weak. Weak. The word is prize. Prize. The word is done. Done. The word is team. Team. Alrighty, the next part we are going to be segmenting the syllables. So for example, I say the word, you say the word, and then we split it into the syllables that it is. So the word is behind, you say behind, be behind. Ready? Here we go. The word is pencil, pencil, pen, so. The word is gentle, gentle. The word is laughter. 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 The word is flower. 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 The word is center. Center. The word is kindness. Kindness. The word is discover, discover. The word is suddenly, suddenly. The word is studio, studio, studio. All right, good job. For our next part, we're going to be putting syllables together. So we're gonna do one syllable, two syllable, Put them together. Ready? So I'm going to say nap. You're going to say nap. Add kin. Kin. Napkin. All right. Ready? In. Add volve. Involve. Involve. Ready? In. Vent. In. Vent. Invent. In sect. In sect. Insect. In dex. In dex. Index. Six. Teen. Six. Teen. Sixteen. Last one. Six. T. Six, T, sixty. Great job. All right, for our next part, this is another new thing we're doing is deleting syllables. So it's not the whole word, just a syllable or sort of sound. So for example, this is going to be one syllable. This is going to be the next syllable. So I'm going to say the word is tablet. You say tablet, tab. Let take away tab. Let. All right, ready? The word is forget. Forget. Take away get. For. The word is forty. Take away t. For. The word is forgot. Take away got. Four. 
That was a lot of fours. All right, the word is below. Take away low. B, the word is begin. Take away gin. B, the word is report. Take away port. Re, the word is remake. Take away make. Re, the word is invent. Take away vent. In, great job, we're almost done. This next part might just be my favorite. It's called substituting syllables. So we're gonna change part of the word, not the whole word, just part of the sounds. So, here we go. The word is teaching. Ta change teach to draw. Drawing. All right, the word is bravest. Change brave to small. Smallest. The word is smallest. Change small to loud. Loudest. The word is loudest. Change loud to tall. Tallest. The word is tallest. Change tall to large. Largest. The word is largest. Change large to bright. Brightest. Good job, one more. The word is brightest. Change bright to low. Lowest. Great job. All right, last part, I'm gonna say a sentence. You're gonna repeat the sentence and we're gonna count how many words it has. So, first sentence. What is the weather today? What is the weather today? What is the weather today? Five words. Next sentence. We listen to our teacher. We listen to our teacher. We listen to our teacher. Five words. Next up. My yellow pencil is very sharp. My yellow pencil is very sharp. Six words. Last sentence we have is, what do you play at recess? What do you play at recess? What do you play at recess? Six words. Alrighty, friends, thank you for joining me. And Yeti, it was week three, lesson one. Thanks for coming.